If you see the notification that you don't have the power that comes to the thermostat, usually on the Nest thermostat it will show that the R terminal doesn't receive any power. First thing that you can do is remove this thermostat, just pull it out and check if the wire all the way in. In our case everything is fine and we can put it back. In some cases some thermostats can show you this error when the battery that installed in the thermostat itself has died but our thermostat has built-in battery and this is not the case in this scenario. There is another thing that can cause this problem and that most likely will surprise you. As you may know, every three to four months you have to replace the AC filter in your attic unit. And in order to do so, you go to the attic and you turn it on the light. And some people will mistake this switch with a switch that installed as an emergency shutdown for the unit. Usually switches in the attic marked, this is attic light switch and this is our unit. And you can see it turned off. And when you turn it on, you can hear the sound that the unit is starting. And this is one of the most common problems with the thermostat when it shows that you don't have any power. Of course, there is more to it. And sometimes in the unit itself, there is a fuse installed on the motherboard. Sometimes it blows up and the unit stops working. But this is really rare situation. And it usually happens when you have some sort of shortage when you replace one thermostat with another. You didn't turn off the power. That may cause this issue. Now let's go and check our thermostat. And that is exactly the issue that happened with your thermostat. And most likely you are a responsible owner who does the proper maintenance for his house and accidentally turn off your switch. If you like this video, you might want to watch this video with explanation of the wiring of the thermostat. Thanks for watching. See you next one.